real motivation is incredibly difficult to find and to keep in your mind, right? And this is because if you don't have morals or values that you hold and you develop and keep for yourself and that you don't let yourself waver from, that motivation is not going to be enough to keep you going, right? And even then, if you do have a, a very strong motivation, like let's say something external, like develop, like getting a relationship or buying a new car, or buying a house, once you get there, that motivation is not going to magically reappear in something else that you want. You're going to have to find something else that you want. And it's just going to be this endless cycle of wanting and wanting or uh, striving for this goal, right? But instead, if you have morals and values that you build, like discipline, uh, getting up early every day, uh, making sure your room is always clean, um, being uh, very strict with yourself on the foods that you, you only want to eat and uh, things like that, right? Well, that's what I mean by morals or values. I went a little bit further with uh, actual activities that, that come from them, come from them like keeping your clean, room clean, but it's the same concept. These are going to be set in stone and you're not going to waver from them. And that's what's going to keep you going, keep you having the right actions in your life, right? Because external sources of motivation are only going to do so much for us. And eventually you're just going to realize that you don't even need it or that you don't really even want that. And then what? Your motivation is going to fall and you're going to feel like not doing anything and you're just going to go right back to the old habits that you had.